Upper Marx, Arc Sector Segments Question. Save this video as part of your revision for that. We have a sector here, and it says the sector has perimeter 25 centimeters. Find feta to 1 dp. All right. What if the perimeter is 25? We have 9 and 9. 9 plus 9 is 18. That must mean that this is 7. So they all add up to 25. So the arc length is 7. And it's this arc length that's going to allow us to work out feta. Now, what is the formula for arc length? Well, at GCSE, because we're not working with radians, this angle here is in degrees, which in the diagram it would probably look something like this. So you work out what ratio or what fraction this is relative to a full circle, which is feta over 360, times that fraction of the full circumference of a circle, which is 2 times pi times the radius. And the radius here is 9. And we're saying that equals 7. Okay? Now we can actually do this all in one step. Let me show you guys how you can do that. Because it's uh, calculated paper stuff, we can do most of our business on this. So what I'm going to do is, you have that over 360, right? So I'm just going to type in 2, pi, 2 times pi times 9 divided by 360. Yeah, so we're going to do fraction 2 times pi times 9 all over 360. 1 over 20 pi, whoops. So 1 over 20 pi is what that left side simplifies to. So you're doing pi times that 1 over 20 pi is 7. So what we're going to do is 7 divided by that to get our answer. 7 divided by the answer is 44.56, etc. They want it to 1 dp. So that's 44.6 degrees. Yeah, so what I did, I did pi times 1 over 20 pi. Feta times 1 over 20 pi is 7. So I did 7 divided by that answer to give me this. So actually, it could be solved pretty simply. So say this video is part of your arc sector segments revision. Head to Neil Does Mass on YouTube for more comprehensive GCSE tutorials. Don't forget about the cram course happening before your paper too. Uh, it's completely free. Sign up with the link in my bio. It has an Excel focus. I'll see you guys in the next video. Nice.